Shalom. So I mentioned that it's strange how a bunch of Ukrainian soldiers are suddenly speaking, speaking perfect English and fighting so much better. It's because NATO is on the ground inside the country. And this is not a new thing. It's been done in every conflict before and will be done again in the conflicts ahead. Now they're releasing an article, NATO fighting against Russia in Ukraine, says security chief in Russia. Russia's responded. It is stated that NATO member states are involved in planning military operations and are blackmailing with the use of weapons of mass destruction. The NATO alliance is fighting against us and its members are providing the Kyiv regime with heavy weapons, ammunition and reconnaissance data and training military specialists, the chief said. NATO member states are involved in planning military operations. Parachuf pointed out these are not empty threats. The United States and its allies have long been implementing their plans to create biological weapons in laboratories set up across the world, in particular near Russian borders. Some laboratories, as we know, were located in Ukraine and were used to create especially dangerous pathogens, the security chief explained. Now, we've heard this said before by Russia that they've actually found these laboratories and destroyed them, that they have proof and footage and it's been suppressed, that NATO and America have been creating these things which are against the laws set in place after World War I already when we last used chemical warfare on each other. So there's a lot in that and it wouldn't surprise me at all. I'm not one of the people that would say no ways, definitely not. I would say probably absolutely yes. But um, yeah, interesting. They're calling them out and saying they know that they're in there and they know the troops are in there and they know the involvement. So they're literally saying we have legal right to retaliate on any of you whenever we feel like it. That's the threat underlying the statement that this chief is giving out at the moment. So again, ratcheting the tensions higher and higher as we go forward into this month of October, which is going to be insane. Keep watching. God bless and Shalom.